I jumped backwards and slammed the roof with my bat. The sound was intense as a huge drum, and the noise woke up the people who were captivated by our fight. The silence returned, and the chorus of the Higurashi filled the air. We started to move slowly and increase the distance between us. Everyone realized it. This fight was ending very soon. <笑>おい、おい、この戦いはお互い賭けてるものがあったのか。お前、そのために戦ってたんじゃなかったのかよ。そうだったっけ。ごめん、忘れちゃってた。ちえ、仕方ねえやつだな。確認するぜ。まず
どうしてこんなにも大好きなケイチ君と私はこんなことをしてるんだろうさーてなどうして俺たちは屋根の上になんかいるんだ何しに俺たちはここへ登ったんだっけ<笑>どうしてだったっけ忘れちゃったよバカと煙は上へ登るってやつだろじゃあ俺たちは二人とも大バカだなバカ仲間だね仲間だな<笑><笑>じゃあそろそろ行こうじゃないか。そして、ね、俺たちは今、ここの屋根の上に登ってるんだよ。どうしてそんなことが起こったんだろうね。I shook my head slowly. Dameda, Ketchuk was still on the Janai to Waranai. Sekak no Oreto Mino Tadagaina. What we am as a Damananda? Kiren, you are an I to Damananda. Conan Okashi, Hotostara, don't you got them on the Ketemo? Go hobby and Nashi in Arukamosina. So no Dogmo Uramiko and Nashta. だから先に言っとく何楽しかったぜ私もだよレナ仮に俺たちのどちらかが死のうと俺たちは絶対にまた会えるからだからまた会えたなら今度は普通に遊んで普通に笑い合って普通に恋をしよう絶対に互いを疑わない互いを絶対に信じ合うだから絶対に会えるよね絶対だよねあ,あ絶対だ Tears appeared in Rena's eyes I noticed I was about to break down too じゃあ行くぜ There was no signal But we step forward at the same time. Our shadows jumped in the moonlight. We were fighting so viciously earlier, but now it was like we were moving very slowly. We must have looked like a shadow play. Everyone was watching the shadows dance. Rinna's shadow hit my metal bat violently. As a result, I let go of it. The metal bat bounced once on the roof, then rolled down to the schoolyard. I'd lost my weapon. Here was Rinna's chance. Of course, she wouldn't miss it. I was lying flat on the roof, and Rinna got on top of me. Rinna's knees were holding down my arms, and there was no way for me to fight back. The moon was divided into two. The shadow of Rinna's hatchet had split the moon right down the middle. This was the end. Rena's arms were still raised, but tears were pouring from her eyes.
お前そうか気づいたのかこの世界で自分で自分が信じられないよこんなにもあんなにも楽しい日々だったのにどうして私はどうして私は何の不満もなかったし何の不安もなかったのにどうして自分で壊してしまうような真似をレナお前はやっぱりすげえよ After I killed you and Mion, I didn't realize I'd done anything wrong, so I left a note and called Oishi san. I still believed that someone else was at fault. Until, I mean, even after I was dead, I didn't even notice I had sinned. How sad it was to kill my friends because of a little misunderstanding, even when they were trying to help me. And how painful it was to not realize it was a sin. だからレナはすごいんだよ仲間を一人も殺さなかったお前は罪を犯す前にキスさすがだよレナさすがだよ俺とは違うんだ Rena stood up slowly and lowered her hatchet. Nakama of Kizuzketa, me chan ni hidoi koto sta. Ato de Hayamatoke, or a taking your tobunida, Shimai no irregario mukete, Chodo e Kizato da tomotezo. So any Kurosha termone, huh? Taramo Kurosta Nido, Doro Kurosta, Mami Arina. Uh, that's okay, they were bad people. Nobody really cares about them at all, actually. I grabbed Rinna's head and embraced her. Then I told her. I told her something so simple. You don't have to murder people, Rinna. It was so simple that anyone could think of it. But Rinna didn't do it. I didn't do it either back then. It was so simple. Rena cried in my arms for a while. She cried about the wrong choice she made at the very beginning. The choice couldn't have been hard to see. I'm sure it was something like something that was within her grasp. How stupid it was to worry about it by herself. She had friends. She had friends whom she trusted. Why did she think she couldn't talk to her friends about it? <laughs> We will trust each other. We will never doubt our friends. We will rely on each other. We will talk to each other and help each other. That's why friends are always happy and why we can endure anything together. じゃあ、レナ、幕の下り
we stood up together, holding hands. The moon was hanging behind us. When I nodded, Rena threw away her hatchet. It disappeared into the darkness below. Then I spoke to the audience in hell, the demons who weren't expecting this ending. I was proclaiming victory. これで It's probably the best end the best ending we've had so far in terms of people not dying. Ooh, that was a long one. On June 25th, the suspect Rina Ryugu broke into the Forest Service field office in Hinamizawa. She forced her way into the classroom of the local school, housed within the office complex, and proceeded to take 25 people hostage. The suspect scattered around a large quantity of gasoline, held the school hostage for over seven hours. The situation remained in a deadlock for some time, but at, what is that, 6.45, several hostages resisted, fled from the building. At the same time, a special unit arrived on the scene, 24 of the hostages were safely rescued. The remaining hostage fled to the roof, and after a brief pursuit, the suspect engaged him in close combat. At 7.10, she agreed to disarm and surrender, freeing the final hostage. Mian was captured around noon. Minor injuries. Rika had minor injuries. Satoko fell and suffered minor injuries during her escape. Keiichi received minor injuries when he engaged in combat with the suspect. She disarmed and surrendered to the police at 7.10 and was subsequently arrested. She was taken to Akinamiya police station and questioned. She admitted to the outline given above. There's been some dispute about the accountability of the suspect during the crime, but after subjecting her to a psych say, psychiatric examination, the prosecution determined the suspect is fully accountable for her actions. The defense is in direct opposition to this and has submitted their own psychiatric examination report Denying the suspect's accountability. The trial is currently in session. She might have just had a little bit of insanity. that nobody died i mean except for the you know the two bad people they died but that's okay nobody really cares about them <laughs> the scenario jump mode has been unlocked it's very scary sounds boing and we got the demon script All right, well, seeing as that was a, like, three and a half hour recording, I'm going to leave it off there. We do have, uh, that last tip, the demon script, and then we also have the, uh, the staff room thing, which we'll look at next time, but for now, that's mostly it. That was a good chapter. Definitely revealed a lot. Definitely sort of 
interconnected the stories together a little bit, which shown Keiichi remembers stuff from the past and that Rika, not Rika, yeah, Rika. Am I, re yeah, Rika, sorry. <laughs> it's all these R names. Um, Rika has, uh, is definitely not a regular small girl. There's definitely something going on with her. Now, I should also mention as well that... Let me see if they've updated. Hold on. Okay, cool. So it looks like, I think since I started this chapter, maybe, that they've updated, uh, or that it's been released on Steam... The seventh chapter, Mina Gor Goroshi, Mina, Mina Goroshi, I think. And it also looks like the, um, the patching software I've been using to patch the sprites and, um, the backgrounds and stuff in, it looks like they actually have a uh, chapter seven in. So that's kind of cool. I don't remember seeing that one before, so I think they must have recently done that. So, anyway, that's it for now. Um, like usual, let me know if there's anything of interest that you guys would like me to know of, or any questions you have, and I could answer those. And we'll be getting back next time to uh, finish it off. Hopefully, I don't think the last one was that long, because the last one was that staff room thing rather than all of the kids sitting around talking for like half an hour. So we could probably finish it up pretty quick. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. And I'll see you next time for some more Higurashi. Bye.